Hey what's up guys this is the Pace and in this video I'm going to show you how you can get the Android P feature in any Android. So if you proceed if you haven't subscribed us subscribe us and also hit the bell icon to get notification about all of future videos. Now if you done that let's get started. So first thing that you need your device must be running on the Android 8.1 Oreo. If your device is not running on Android 8.1 Oreo then you can install any custom rom that is available for your device. So next you have to install Expose framework on your device and there is many different methods are available to install Expose and I am going to show you one of them. Now first I am suppose that you already install the Magix manager on your device. So if you install the Magix manager just go to Magix manager and go to download and search for Expose and go for the Expose framework SDK 27 and just download it and install it on your device. Once it installed just reboot your device. And after that just download the Expose installer apk from the link in the description of the video and install it and open it. So as Expose is installed in your mobile, now you can install the Expose module. So just go to link in the description and download this Expose module that is Android PIFY and just download it and install it on your device and just activate this module from the Expose manager. So just open your Expose manager app and swipe from the left, go to module and just enable the module Android PIFI and just reboot your device to apply all the changes. Now after reboot you can see the changes in your notification panel. You can see that your notification panel gets turned just like Android P. And you can also go to settings and see the changes. You will get a beautiful color icon in your settings menu and it just looks like an Android P. Now the next we have Android P launcher and this is the modded version of the Google Pixel launcher so you can go to link in the description and just download it and install it on your device. This launcher will give you just like Android P look and feel in your device. Now next we have Android P volume slider so you can go to link in the description or you can also go to Google Play Store and just download it and install this application on your device. So once you install this give it do not disturb access and enable it. You will get a volume slider like Android P and with this you can control the volume of media, notification or alarm of your device. Now the next we have the markup app and this app will give you a screenshot editing feature just like Android P. So you just have to download this app from link in the description of the video and install it. Now you can just take a screenshot of your screen and just share it with your markup app. And this will give you an editing feature on your screenshot and you can also save it and share it with anyone. Now the next we have Android P wallpaper. So you can just go to link in the description and you can download the Android P wallpaper from there. And once you download you can just apply whatever wallpaper you like it and just set it. So this is how you can get the Android P wallpaper. Now the next we have Android P Notch and to get Notch you can install the X out of 10 application from Play Store and just install it on your device and open it. Now you can just click on start button to get a default Notch on your device and if you want to play with this Notch size you can click on the change DPI and you can change the size of the Notch from here. Now the next if you want to change the number of android version from your settings menu so you can just go to link in the description and download this brul prop editor and install it in grant root permission and just find this line of the code that is rl.bullprop.version.release and just change your 8.1.0 to 9.0 and once you change it just click on save and reboot your device to apply it. And after you would you can just go to about phone and see the changes and it will just change the number here it will not update your device or upgrade your device it will just change this number here. Now the last thing is Android P like no media sounds on a device and to get it you have to download uh, any file manager with root access. So once you're done with that you have to download all this file from link in the description and just select all of them and copy it and go to your system directory then go to folder called system 
then find the folder called media and inside this media folder you will get a folder called audio and just go to this folder audio and here you have to paste all of this file and once you're done with that you have to reboot your device to make all the changes and you will get a media volumes like a uh, notification ringtone and all those things like android p so guys that's it for this video i hope you like it don't forget to do subscribe and also hit the bell icon and if you haven't followed me on my social account then you can go to link in the description and follow me on my social account so guys this is the page signing out meet you soon in next video